Hello again everyone, it is your Black Knight. If you're seeing this video, then I'm just about ready to start uploading basically my backlog, the videos I have been working on and I haven't had a chance to fully edit, you know, the stuff that I'm falling behind on. We got some Cayo Perico races coming out, some stuff to do with the whole Sprunky Cola thing, some some bus bunches of randomness, a few videos where my mic was completely jacked up and it was using the Logitech mic, not now Lester. A bunch of different things are going to be coming out, and I'm just trying to get everything kind of caught up so that if I make a video, it's relevant, you know. And uh, it, I might be a little bit busy for a little while. There's a lot going on, and I've got a lot of things to do as the fall rolls in. It's, life is busy, you know. It's, life is busy, and this isn't my profession. It's a hobby, so I'll be doing my hobby as I my hobby can be done. So... No need to worry if you're you're not seeing a ton and ton of videos anymore. Look how green that is. Hi, Kermit. But uh, don't worry, I'm still making videos. Don't don't unsubscribe. We're just just busy. But I have a lot of videos. I'm trying to get caught up as far as editing is concerned and stuff like that. I've done a couple things here. I had one video kind of go south because for some reason the mic didn't work at all. Um, so the video where I sold off two of my hot ring racers here. And I decided to keep one extra one on my other character that has the split E. coli sprunk livery. Just because I don't know if that's going to be a temporary thing. I'll keep one as a collectible. But I just, I've got these here. I could have put a, another green car on the end there. But I put that up in another garage with all my kind of my old school cars. Because it was an kind of original or really early DLC cars. So it's not all my cars. But those, that was the theme of those ten cars that I have put there. And it really doesn't even matter. No, no, no it doesn't. So, what we're going to do now is we're going to buy a car. Because this is one of the things I want to be able to do. This is something I've been planning on doing. 2.9, basically. Uh, I do plan on still doing some racing on here. I don't know that I'm going to be grinding as hard as I can for... We're at 124 million. This will drop us to like 120. 120 million is enough. That's good enough, really. I mean, you know, we can... We'll order it in black just because I don't even know what it's going to be. Maybe it'll stay black. Maybe it won't be black. Maybe it'll be something else. I don't know. We're going to look at what liveries are available and then build from there. But I do want one of these so I could try some stunt races on it. And strangely enough, with my, my main character is now at rank 777. That's kind of cool. I'm thinking, I wonder if I should just work this character for a while. And... Uh, and build this up from the 300s up a little bit. And leave that just be as a 777 for a little while. Lucky 777. I got the, the tattoo for it and everything if I wanted to put that on. That I unlocked. So now we're just waiting for a black Lambo to arrive. I assume it's going to pop in behind me. But yeah, I've got a whole bunch of stuff that I've, got, I've been working on editing. And trying to get ready for upload. And it's just it's just going to be trying to get caught up for a little while here. And then filtering it. If I do any racing, I'll put that up on the next Sunday as soon as I can. Because that's always a, a nice thing to relax with is a little bit of racing. It's hard to find racers anymore. A lot of times I go in and I've got, a, like, nobody's in the lobby for any of these races. For when I have the time to race them. That's a pretty car, too. Um, yeah. I mean, so that that's kind of going to drive how things go. You look for... You know, double money or triple money or weekends and run with it because that's a lot of times the only time you get racers, you know. I want to start doing more 5M stuff, but I'm thinking maybe I've got my system stable enough just from randomly working on stuff and getting some updates into it and doing different things. I did change the internet on, and that seems to have helped a lot. And so I've got faster internet now, so we'll see how things go. So I do, I do want to do some more racing. Um, maybe some 5M, some stuff in the future, if I could get, you know, back, you know, I'd say get back with Bruffy, but that's, like, such a time investment. If I to race on his streams, you need, like, to wheel right off the whole day. I never get a chance to do that. It just doesn't happen. Matter of fact, I think he's on now. I'm not even watching. I have to, to throw that on at some point. Hey, it, it popped in while I wasn't looking. And look at this. To catch up on that stream and see what he's doing with the G-Fred today. Interesting side note, like what I've been doing whenever I get a car anymore is I run that the custom map where I, I practice taking the car up Chiliad just to do a whole, you know, will this car go up Chiliad kind of thing. Hopefully he's okay with all that. We'll see how it goes. The, the good news is, is 
my clientele for who watches my videos is very, very small. This is very much a hobbyist kind of thing. I'm not making dollars off of it. So, really, if anything, I'm just promoting the G Freds. So I'm not, it's not like I'm, I'm gaining a whole lot here, gang. It's uh, the same people watch my stuff who watch my stuff. I get five hits, I'm doing good. So, we'll see how that goes. But right now, we have this Torero, which is a car that I've been wanting to drive because I do like it. It does look good in black. I gotta admit, I wasn't gonna keep it black, but let's, let's, before we do anything, liveries. We got the tri color livery. Okay, that's, that's been kind of a standard on them as of late. Obviously, we can't see that. White Pegasi. Okay, so that just looks like that's the classic Pegasi line two tone. Ooh. There's something to that. I wonder if it's always gray or just a different light, you know, color of the same, a different shade of the same color. White Pinstripe. Red Pinstripe. Yogarishima. Yogarishima. I wonder what that translates to. Okay, it's. Street Kisima. Not sure that or domestic Japanese European. Okay, well maybe the European. Redwood Rally. Not calling to me. Split. Why do they do these split camo cars? I don't know. Just give me a camo car. It's why split camo. Before and after. Like you got, you got a discount on it, so you can show off the before and after. Monochrome. Not not calling to me as it is. Or probably it's a so we're back to none. Huh. So so I think it's gonna matter what color I pick. Well you know, let's pick black and put the white Pegasi on it. Something simple. Let's get started here. Armor, bang, brakes. Bang. Bumpers. Front bumper. Um, secondary splitter. So we could give it this a couple of colors here. Ford splitter. Big honking. I think we'll just go secondary splitter. I'm not big on, on huge splitters and all that because I feel like I get caught on the ground with it. I like kind of just, I, I love kind of the, the look of the whole thing. You know, I, I really should have one that looks like that because, you know. Didn't, um, didn't Tavarish have something along those lines? Secondary diffuser. Let's do that. Wing diffuser. Looks a bit excessive to me, you know, it's just. How, how much different does that look from this? Yeah, it's just secondary. More colors to it. There's a lot of stuff you could do there. Canards. Boy, I'm really not into canards. I don't know why. Engine. Rev it up. Maybe someday I'll be in a completely different frame of mind, you know? like 17 variations on the same theme. Let's go titanium hood. Single vented hood. Double vent. More vents. Forged. No secondaries. That's interesting. Not a lot of variation there, but we'll go for the high end on this one. So, you know. Lights. Headlights. Those should probably be Xenons. Neon kits, neon layout, front, back, sides. Color we'll hold off on. Livery, again, we didn't... We're still looking... Let's look at the, uh, the respray. Primary color in the metallics. Carbon black does look kind of good. But we're not limited here. And a classic, you know, Ferrari kind of... Lamborghini red sort of things. Italian sort of things. Garnet red. This was the color of that Tempesta. <coughs> you could win for a little while. Not a bad look. Wine red. It's a little too subdued for the car, I think. Candy red. Candy red with a white stripe. 
Hot pink. We must consider all things here. Fister pink. Eh. Wrong brand. Has they, if anyone ordered a salmon pink Lamborghini, would the guy just slap you? I think there'd be some slapping. I could just dunk my empty soda bottle over. Anything left in it? My mouth is getting dry. Mm. A little bit of root beer. That helps. I mean, the oranges are my, my kind of my standard sort of thing on this character. Almost to the point of it's excessive. Bright orange. I could give it the crew blue effect. Olive green. It's kind of how I went with the Ignis. Gasoline green. It's not a bad look. I always want to include more gasoline green stuff in, and then whenever I get it, it's always like, well, there's something I like a little bit better. This is not my color. Midnight blue, a little too dark. Galaxy blue, dark blue. Saxon, a little, yeah, a little too subdued for the vehicle. Blue. Diamond blue. Dun, dun. Surf blue. We could just go completely um, wrong with this and make the secondary orange. We could think about that. Nautical blue, 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 and even more blue. Brown, 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 brown. No. Purplish. These do lend themselves to purple. I will say that. That is a good looking purple. I feel like they're all going to be purple though. Now yeah, we're through with the white uh, thing. We can't get lime green yet. I need to eat myself off some more jumps. Finding them though, that's the whole. To do frost white with that, you know, with, the, with either the rainbow stripe, the, the Italian stripes, or the black Pegasi, that would look good. Surf blue. Pearlescent diamond blue. Secondary color, metallic. I had no plans of going wrong with this. Yellow, yellow, bronze, bright orange. There you go. We need to somehow put some more secondary on this thing, though. Trim color. That will help. Roof. Carbon. Did everybody just completely forget about the um, the secondary on this thing? Let's go something forged. Forged streamlined roof, because we're using a little bit forged in here, so it's kind of consistent. Skirts. Secondary extra large skirts. Secondary street skirts. How does that look? Secondary forged XL skirts. That's that could work. Secondary forged street. Might have to just get more aggressive. Forge extended ducktail. Low level wing. If they gave us a secondary, that would be great. The Pegasi wing starts to edge out. Eh, still not catching anything. Let's go with the Pegasi wing. Forged Pegasi wing. Do we want to make it forged? We could. I've thrown away a lot of money. Super wing. Ooh, now that... I should have waited for the super wing. Look at that. That is a Lambo. That's a true Lambo wing. 
But yeah, we're not a forge in this case. This that, that needs to be a body color. Super wing. And that's that that's the the classic kind of forward V Lamborghini kind of thing. Suspension, I, I don't know if you have to slam everything anymore, but you might. Trunk, stock, forward trunk, dividend, everything's. No secondaries. Forge ridge line trunk. Is there like something with just a little forged on it? Like a strip of forged. Forged Ridgeline, India Turbo, vents, stock vents, secondary vent, there we go, we need a little bit of Ron Livery to show off here, wheels, oh, my intent is to go, you know, pretty much full stock for the wheels, because those are pretty neat, but you know, we're, we're trying to get more orange on this, track tires, rally throwback, Monoblock Forged 5 Speed Boy 90s Running Tropos and yeah, the Tropos Rally kind of stuff might work on this. That does look good. Pure Business Pepper Pot Pepper Pot's could work. Blacktop Blender Throwback isn't that far off from what the, the stocks are. Super turbines look good on this car too. Giga mesh kind of work. Nah. Probably look at tuners. That's a lot more. A lot more rubber, and it might help. It might help handling there if it has tires can clip. I don't know if it does. Does it look like it fits the car though? You know, it just seems like this car should have maybe high ends. Blade. Cheetah RR, Solar, Carbon Inferno kind of looks good in Carbon Shadow, but, and Carbon Z. The Carbon Zs look pretty good. It's either Inferno or Z. It's gone with the Z. Wheel Color. You don't get a lot of color, but you get some. Just enough. I think that's... It enhances it without being over the top. No, we're not going to put the lettering on it. Tire smoke. Orange. Windows light smoke. But now we're going to come back down through stuff. So armor we've already done. Brakes and bumpers. <coughs> Front bumper. No. Secondary Forge Splitter, Forge Street, Secondary Forge Street. That it's, it does seem to enhance it now a little bit when you start matching things up, doesn't it? Drag Splitter. The Drag Splitter kind of matches up with the street one on the side. Is that too much wing? Too much side wing. I don't think so. I think, I think it's going to work. Secondary wing diffuser. F 
reforged wing diffuser. You're going to reforge wing diffuser. Secondary forge aggressive. So many titles. No, that's definitely this up here, though. And it's changing my mind on the on the rear wing too. Canards. Are we just gonna go completely wild on this? It gives it a lot of full grill covers. What the? Oh, that covers that up. Okay. Dual forged kit. Look how it changes the grill around. I'll leave some forged canards on. I'm not usually a canard guy. Livery. Now we have to start thinking. Tricolor. Nah. Black Pegasi. White Pegasi. No, oh, Black Pegasi. Roof we're done with, skirts we're done with, spoiler, forged, super wing. The mix of black, orange, and blue does work for me, I think. I think we're done here. You can see in there. This is a nice mix, I think. Yeah, it's the Ron the official Ron team, you know, team Ron colors, of which I'm not on really. But it's a good look. Let's see how it does up Chiliad. My jobs, races. God only knows if I'll ever get in a G for it again. I know I'm still not ready. But this I'll have good practice on this, I hope. I really need to practice it with, you know, point to point GTA. Supers. Noon. Clear. Leave the rest of it. See which direction is it in. Direction am I gonna have to go back? Up oh, there we are. Looks even more subdued in those in uh, this lighting. Purchase all ammo, might as well. There we go. I like in the car, it looks, it has a lot of texture to it, you know? Now, where is the point at which I'm supposed to jump? I hope it was that one, because that's where we... Oh, wow. Little bouncy. Man, I should have left the, the, the uh, suspension way up high for doing this kind of thing. Whoa! Oh, wow, this is even wandering more than the cyclone did. Still haven't taken Pankro's, Pankro Jones' advice and gotten a controller for this thing yet. I know there's got to be one around, but... Wow! That really did launch it there. Oh, we should change the bottom lights to orange. Well, remind me to get to that. Won't affect the performance, but you know we should do that. Make that an orange thing for the. Oh, I missed the. I missed the point. Well, we can work with this, I think. I missed the proper injection point. Uh, well, it certainly seems to be hustling. Mm -hmm. 
bouncy as all heck. Wow, it's, that's the only problem, is it's really bouncy. Oh dear. Well, this is even worse than what we did in the cyclone. Um, I think we're going to have to reset, honestly. Let's see. Can I pull it all the way back up the wrong side of the hill? Don't hit a tree. Okay, G Fred Spirit. It hits the slightest thing, it just flips this car. It must be so light. Oh dear, I wasn't even going to where I'm supposed to. Alright, we gotta go up this way. Ah! I think we might be completely screwed here. All right, let's let's let this thing try to make a legend out of itself. One way or the bad or good. Sometimes you have to go down to go up. How did he even do that? Okay, I would I would rank this as a very good Chilean ascent car. It doesn't seem to have any trouble with climbing the mountain. It's just bouncing its way down the mountain ram randomly because it's too fast. Like, I'm not worried about needing mom keep momentum up on this car. It will just pull from a stop and go where it needs to go. And some planes, places it shouldn't go. Look at that! It's still got a functioning spoiler! On top of the other spoiler, normally when you add a spoiler, then the the, 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 the flexing spoiler goes away. So is having this giant wing on the back completely superfluous now? Or just a double wing car? Do we do we get the tr do we get any kind of traction assist? Or bet you we don't. I bet you it's like straight up downforce or something. I recall there is a problem with the uh, the spoilers like that not giving a boost. Although I'll tell you what, I feel like having the both of them look silly. Please don't blow up. I've been blowing up a lot as of late. Oh my goodness. Where are all these, these cars blowing up? Don't go that way. I have been blowing up a lot as of late. It's not been intentional. Is it just that they're carrying so much speed as they're falling down? Is there, is there a point when the map says, Oh, you've fallen off a cliff. We're going to blow you up. I am on the brakes. It is just flying down. No gas. Full reverse. Come on, pull it up. 
frisbee. Yeah, if the if the uh, if the secondary spoiler there, if the main like auto mag spoiler didn't come up, it would look cool. As it looks there, kind of just snugging up the distance on the main spoiler there, the big spoiler, it looks dang silly. Oh, we made it down after one death. Bouncy, bouncy, bouncy. Yeah, the double wing thing. Like, I like the look of the main spoiler because it's very Kuntosh. But with the other one there, I'm thinking we might strip it. We'll see how it looks stripped off and then... No, 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 stop. Okay, there's not water there, but... So that was our last chance to drown ourselves, but not our last chance to get stuck. All right. Through the sheep pen. I assume it's for sheep. See, the highway section is where this thing would really excel. It does have a good top speed. Assuming they keep it that way in Project Homecoming, because again, you're not going to see this in traffic. Wow, it does not like bounces. This is a bouncy boy. I did. I did not handle that that very well. No. Let's go old school. The jump is the faster way to... Oh, geez. This is already not a fast run. The car has so much potential, but it's also so wildly unstable on, on off-roady kind of things. It's a bouncy boingy boingy bouncy bingy boo! We're already airborne. Do a barrel roll! Okay, that's... through over and under and through okay we're, we're not done here because what we're going to do is I think I'm going to take that wing off just because we already have a wing unless like this having the spoiler negates the fact that you'd only get the speed you know, does it give you traction at low speeds in addition like is it an actual performance enhancing thing or does it just look dang silly should I keep it just because it's dang silly? At any rate, we have to make the bottom color orange. So, bear with me while we fly back. To the agency. All right, we'll keep the double wing. Simply because it gives it more forged. And maybe they'll fix it someday where you're not getting double wings and then we'll, we'll have what we intended. How am I, often am I going to raise it? I don't even know. It is a bit slippy and slidey in places. This is my building. I should probably just go in here. Chomp. And no one's gonna ding the doors that way. Ha <laughs>
You know one thing we could look at? Does it give it a traction boost in the little menu? Because that usually does tell the tale. Now go back up and down. Let's go. Dooba 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 dooba. Dooba 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 dooba. So I do like the way that looks just sitting there. That's a Lamborghini wing. There you go. Now, look at that traction doesn't change. They're just It's just there. No, look at that. What that does, it does get some kind of traction bonus according to the thing. So, it does, if you take if you go stock, then some of it goes down. I don't know. I don't know what to tell you, gang. None of this is behaving as it would, you know, as you'd think a GTA thing should work. But you know, there, there's there's some things going on here. I will say this, I do like it. Got, yeah, I got the gold foil colors. A little darker take with all this. For, I don't know what forged is supposed to mean. I mean. Is that forged carbon fiber? Orange interior. A little orange cross brace there. I think we can call that good. Tempted to paint this one brown, and that'll remind me of the the Beamer that my one buddy had. Maybe still has. I'm not sure. But do we want to do that? Did I win this one? And then just throw a, a, a spoiler on it. It looks very stock. That's for another day. And on that note, ladies and gentlemen, let me just remind you that I have a bunch of videos that are coming, kind of coming in out of sync time-wise. They're older videos that I haven't had a chance to put together yet. Um, apologize for the audio on a couple of them. The racing was too good to get rid of it. And stuff like that where you, you, you'll see my voice is tinny and coming through the wrong mic. But we're, we're going we're gonna to get through it. We're going to press ahead and life is going to be good. So on that note, ladies and gentlemen, this is your Black Knight. Have a great night.